A, lo a local favorite roller derby team laced up their skates this weekend and raised funds for a local nonprofit organization. Our Brenda Mack gives us a recap on the fierce competition. Skates up. The Bape City Rollers are back in the ring, competing and fundraising for a greater cause. Oh my goodness, I am wiped out, but I'm totally pumped. It was such a good game. I'm sweating myself and I didn't participate. Though the team did not win against longtime rivals Fargo Moorheads this time around, they sure won the support of the community and also shelters for local pets in need. The money that's raised gets given to the organization, in this case, Great River Rescue. And that, you know, that's just a thrill because we know whether or not Babe City wins the bout, we want the charity to be, come out a winner each night. During each game's halftime, the audience gets to participate in a chuck -a duck throwdown where each rubber duck sold for a dollar goes to a local nonprofit. I bought a few ducks, try to help them out. If I would have won, I would have donated all the winnings back. Bape City Rollers is not your typical roller derby team. I knew the minute I strapped on skates that I was like born to do this. Like this was what I was supposed to be doing. <laughs> Each team member is committed to serving local organizations in the community. It really is. It's, it's nice to have a community event like this where we can bring attention to other uh uh, other agencies in, in the area and you know it's a great time for everybody. We come out here and we have so much fun and it's just a blast. And they will continue their work in upcoming games. We're just happy to be part of this community and, and we're happy that there are, we have partners in the community that believe in what we do. Uh, every animal gets uh, spayed or neutered prior to adoption, it gets vaccines, gets flea tick treatment and uh, the cats get their, their blood tested for kitty diseases and things. Um, so the expenses do, do add up and um, our primary way of, of paying for that is through um, support from the community, whether it's through individual donations or uh, business donations or other forms of support. And for anyone who is interested, check out Babe City Rollers on Facebook and see if you've got what it takes. In Bemidji, Brenna Mack, Lakeland News. Go Babe City! The team trains on Tuesdays and Thursdays and will provide skates for newcomers. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.